Hi everyone, welcome to the session. In this session, I am going to explain about the topic number system and the two, I will explain the concept of a units digit. In the last session, I already explained the concept of a units digit third category, right? Now I will explain the problems based on third category digits in this session, right? Uh, guys, as of now, we learned uh, in the previous sessions, we learned about first category digits uh, that is 0, 1, 5, 6 and also second category digits 4 and 9 and uh, third category digits concept is completed 3, 7, 2, 3, 7, 8, right? Now in this session, we are going to discussing about third category digits problems, okay? How to solve the problems related to third category digits if any number is ending with the uh, third category digits okay let me explain the first example let us take a number 342 whole to the power of 126 342 whole to the power of 126 now if you observe carefully here the number is ending with 2 here the number is ending with what 2 if any number is ending with 2 which belongs to the third category digits then the required units digit is 2 power remainder then the required units digit is 2 power remainder. Now, we need to find the remainder first. How do you get the remainder? By dividing the given power value with 4. By dividing the given power value with 4. So that you will get something remainder. That remainder value you need to substitute uh, over there. Right? Here, and uh, in the last session, I told you one small trick. Don't take entire power value. Take only last two digits. Why? Because divisibility rule of 4 is if last two digits are divisible by 4, that entire number is divisible by 4. Here, the power value, I will take only last two digits, 26. 26 by 4. 26 by 4. Here, the remainder is 2. Remainder is 2. Here, 4, 6, 24. 4, 6, 24. 24. Therefore, the required remainder is 2, right? Now, you can substitute that particular remainder in this case, 2 power 2, which is equal to 4. This is the required units digit. If any number ending with 2 and the power value is this one, then the required units digit is 2 power remainder and the remainder we are getting is 2. Therefore, the answer is 4. Let me explain one more example. See here, 743 whole to the power of 625, 743 or else 635, 743 whole to the power of 635. Here, if you observe carefully, the number is ending with 3, number is ending with 3 and that belongs to third category digits, therefore the required units digit is 3 power remainder, okay. Now we need to find the remainder. Just take only last two digits. Last two digits are 35. 35 divided by 4. 35 divided by 4. Here, it will cancel 8 times. 4 8s are 32. 4 8s are 32. Therefore, the required remainder is 3. Required remainder is 3. Substitute this remainder in this case. 3 power 3, which is equal to 27. But we want only the units place, which is equal to 7. Required units place digit uh, for the number 743 whole to the power of 635, which is equal to 7. That is the answer. Let me explain one more. See here. 638 whole to the power of 762. 638 whole to the power of 762. Here the number is ending with 8. Here the number is ending with 8. Therefore, the required units place is 8 power remainder. Required units place is 8 power remainder. So, take only last two digits. In order to get the remainder, we need to divide the given power value with uh, 4. Here the power value is 762, but don't take entire number. Take only last two digits, 62. 62 divided by 4. 62 divided by 4, the required remainder. Required remainder. Here, 4, uh, 4 15s. 4 15, 60. 4 15, 60. The remainder value is 2. 
the remainder value is 2. Substitute that remainder value in this case. 8 power 2. 8 square is equal to 64. The required units digit. The required units digit is 4. That is the answer for this question. Let me explain one more example. 437 whole to the power of 542. 437 whole to the power of 542. Right? Here, as the number is ending with 7, as the number is ending with 7, therefore the required units place is 7 power remainder. The required units place is 7 power remainder. How do you get the remainder? Just by dividing power value with 4 and don't take entire power value even though the number is like this the power value is like this take only last two digits last two digits are 42 divided by 4 therefore i will get the remainder as 2 substitute that 2 in this case you will get 7 power 2 which is equal to 49 7 square is equal to 49 therefore the required units place value is 9 in this way, we can solve the problems related to the third category digits uh, and you can also apply various uh, multiplications, additions, subtractions, all these kind of uh, arithmetical operations for all three category digits. Now, I will explain one last example by taking uh, the combination of all three categories so that uh, you can able to understand how to solve the problems. Okay, see, let me explain. 325 hold to the power of uh, 325 hold to the power of 612 into 143 hold to the power of uh, 536 okay minus 212 minus 212 hold to the power of 125 212 hold to the power of 125 that is the required answer right here the number is ending with 5. Here the number is ending with 5. So the required units place digit is always 5 as it belongs to first category digits. Now coming to this case. Here this one and this one both are belongs to third category digits or else you can take it as 214 instead of 212 so that it will become second category and this is third category. Here for second category, as the number is ending with 4, as the number is ending with 4 and the power value is odd number and the power value is odd number. For odd power of 4, what is the required units place? 4. For odd power of 4, required units place is 4. This is minus and now we need to calculate the units place digit of the number. Suppose for example, instead of 143, I will take 142. Okay. Why? Because let me explain. See here, here the number is ending with 2. Here the number is ending with uh, 2 and the power value is 536. Take only last uh, two digits. It belongs to third category. 36 divided by the required units digit is what? 2 power remainder. 36 divided by 4. I will get the remainder 0. I will get the remainder 0. But I should not substitute 2 power 0. If I substitute 2 power 0, I will get 1. But this is wrong answer, right? I already told you in the last session, whenever you are getting the remainder 0, take that value as 4 instead of 0. Therefore, 2 power 4. What is 2 power 4 value? 16. Therefore, the required units digit is 6 only. Required units digit is 6. Now, you can multiply these two. You can multiply these two. 5 into 6, 13 minus 4. 30 minus 4, which is equal to 26. Therefore, the required unit digit is 6. The required unit digit is 6 after calculating all these values. Likewise, you can uh, uh, use uh, whatever kind of uh, arithmetical operation for any kind of category. Guys, uh, all these problems uh, belongs to units place digit. Uh, I hope... Uh, each and every category of digits you can understand uh, in units place digit. Uh, now, in the next session, I will explain uh, another concept of uh, number systems. Uh, guys, I hope you enjoyed the session. Thank you. Thank you very much for watching.